Hello everyone, let's talk about teens and their self-worth. You know, a lot of what teenagers do and don't do is deeply tied to their self-worth. If you see that your teen is procrastinating, it is probably because she or he is under-challenged or over-challenged. If you see that your teen is not goal-oriented, it is probably because they are getting these cues from adults or their peers that they don't deserve to aspire to those goals. Believe it or not, so much of what teenagers do is also because of others doing it. So if they don't understand their strengths, they don't understand that they have some limitations, what they will do is they will attempt things that other people, their peers are attempting and they start feeling incompetent. And they can't stay motivated, especially in the face of setbacks, because they don't know that they are not playing to their strengths. Of course, high results are always achieved in the framework of high expectations. So I request you to challenge them, challenge their mediocrity, challenge them from out of their comfort zones to go aspire for bigger and better things. You can ask them questions like, what are the problems that you see in the world that you want to contribute a solution with? How do you plan to leave a positive mark in the world? What are their thoughts? Are they aligning with their actions? Question them. Uh, teach them that it is very, very difficult to love themselves. Because, you know, at the end of the day, we know ourselves a little too well. We don't forgive ourselves easily because we feel like we are inherently flawed. But that is not true. You know, our self-worth doesn't have to rely on what other people think of us and how we feel about ourselves. Every ambitious goal has a first step of starting, of making the first move. Fear is to your team and good luck to his or her self-worth. Thank you.